Frontline health care workers say they are burned out and they need help. Nurses rallied on the steps of City Hall demanding hospitals do more to fill a critical nursing shortage. CBS 2's Kevin Rincon has more. Registered nurses have been leaving the workforce in mass. Even those who love their careers are being forced to make some tough decisions. When you're short staffed, every shift you go in, it's impossible. You know, we get burnt out, we get sick, we can't show up, we have to care for our families. Nicole was diagnosed with breast cancer. Despite being a nurse, she says it was difficult to get the care needed, a result, she says, of shrinking benefits. When she finally decided on a treatment, she stayed at her hospital. I decided to receive treatment at NYP while I continue to work for two reasons. The first one, I needed to maintain my health insurance. The second, I wanted to support my already understaffed colleagues as much as I could. Council Speaker Adrian Adams says two out of three registered nurses across the country are planning to leave. What's clear to all of us is that our nurses are burning out at a rate that is unsustainable for New York City. We are leaving in droves because of our working conditions. Matt Allen was among the nurses who gathered on the steps of City Hall, claiming hospitals are refusing to hire in an effort to save money. They have the capacity to do it, they just don't want to. Mount Sinai is one of several hospitals currently in contract negotiations with the New York State Nurses Association. It says the process may be noisy, but they're committed to negotiating in good faith. Inside City Hall, the Council's Committee on Health got to hear from both sides. You should not be left with the concept that we do not believe in the healthcare workforce. We, none of us exist without that. That hearing here at City Hall was meant to understand the staffing shortage and also for folks to hear what's being done when it comes to retention ahead of a critical deadline. At the end of this month, the contract that represents 17,000 nurses at 12 city hospitals, that will expire. Outside City Hall, Kevin Rincon, CBS 2 News.